my goodness! <laughs> hey friends, it's Jacqueline here. In today's video, I will be sharing with you my Sephora Holiday Savings Event haul. But before we get started, and if you're new here, I hope that you can give me that opportunity and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you ring that post notification bell so you miss any of my vlogs and come and follow me on my Instagram. And now, if you want to know what I have been shopping during this Sephora Holiday Savings Event, then just keep on watching. midnight on the first day of the Sephora sale I went ahead and placed my order online and then the I shouldn't say the following day but the same day but in the morning if you follow me on Instagram you will know by now that I went shopping at my local Sephora I went with my daughter we did some damage right there and I just want to go ahead and share with you what I have gotten I think this is the most exciting kind of like sale of the year in terms of beauty because usually you don't get such a good discount on particular brands and there are some brands right here that you will not get a discount at all and whatsoever with any other store so I think this is a really good time and I really love also the holiday sets they are usually amazing so let me show to you what I got right here talking about holiday sets you know my friends if you have watched my recommendations or my wish list this was on my wish list is the Galaxy Gorgeous by Sol de Janeiro and if you have been watching me for any point in time you know that I love the Boom Boom Cream it's something that I always get I get the big tab the biggie biggie and this set right here I thought it was of an excellent excellent value in fact it has a value of $81 but it costed $62 minus my 20% discount because well I'm a Rouge member and right now when you're watching this video I'm pretty sure when this video goes live if you are a VIB you will get to shop with your discount which is 15% off and for those who are insiders on November 11 you will get to shop the sale ends on November 15th by the way I will be leaving all the details of the sale all the items that I will be showing today in the description box below along with the links and by the way the code that you need to use at checkout is yay holiday so don't forget about that but anyhow friends so yes I pick up this one because I think it's of an excellent value it does have not only my beloved boom boom cream i love these boxes right here is this upside down yes it's upside down <laughs> i love these boxes right here for keepsake i mean for gifting obviously and i love the theme you know brazil sol de janeiro if you know of someone that is going for a tropical vacation during the holidays all these gifts will be amazing but other than that i mean i'm gonna use all these products right here let me show to you what is inside oh my gosh you have all these beauties right here you have that boom boom cream that you know guys again i love it then you also have right here the shower gel the shower gel is so good the scent is just tropical heaven but it's not your typical it's not that coconut you know, no, no 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 it's nothing like that it has pistachios in it it just smells creamy amazing rich tropical vacation total vibes i really love 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 this spray right here after the shower you know just to carry on usually my oldest daughter she carries that all the time with her she has a mini one it's so good and then the body scrub that is something that i actually haven't you know tried it before from sol de janeiro and it's with the same scent of the boom boom cream let's open it up right here Ooh, and it's you know a nice size you know oh it's so cool it's creamy delicious amazing i'm super excited about this right here if you're a person that likes to self-tan before you go ahead and self-tan you want to scrub very well your skin and i love really good nice scrubs and with this scent oh my gosh this is so so good super happy i was able to get it at an amazing price now another set that you know i was eyeing and i wasn't gonna let it pass is by brio geo and this one right here is a honey hydration don't despair repair hair repair kit blah, 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 blah. and it says right here bonus gift shampoo and conditioner okay so you get the shampoo and the conditioner right here and this hair mask right here this one in particular i mean like this is the don't despair repair hair mask but i don't know why but this one that comes in this little cute honey bear <laughs> right there it's so good it's i don't know i feel that it's more hydrating than the original one and this one right here has vegan apple in it so let me just 
smell it. I'm just so curious if it's oh, it's sealed. So hold on. Ah, there you go. Mmm, it smells as good as the original one, the ones that comes in these <laughs> so cute little bear right here, but with a hint of an apple scent. Not too much. I'm super excited to give it a try. I have a ton of these, like backups from every time that I see these kind of set, I always get it. But I don't have this one in particular with the apple in it, with a vegan apple in it. And I'm just super excited because although it's reparative, it's also very nice and hydrating too for your hair. And I'm just super excited about this one. And also, you know, it's always good to have this smaller size of the shampoo and the conditioner on the go. If you're gonna go for traveling, they are easy to package. They don't don't, you know like take too much space and then I went ahead and pick up another one of these GCO honey infused hair oil now this is the smallest size I love the cute packaging right here and I love this hair oil it doesn't weigh your hair down in fact I'm using it right now it's so good and I really need it I said repurchase it honestly I never finished the one that I had but <laughs> there's a story behind it so when we moved back from Florida to California in our bathroom there was a cabinet on the wall and it had a lot of my hair products I'm talking about my Oribe Go Last, um, this Jisoo product, some IGK products too. I mean, I had so many things in there and my husband forgot to pack. So all of that stay in there. And yes, I was never able to get it back. The person who rented the place, I don't know, I mean like, whatever, she must have kept that or whatever. But anyhow, I decided to pick this up because this is a really, really good hair oil and I was missing it. So I'm like, okay, you know, I don't really need another one, but I know in the long run I will need one and I said, you know, why not? Let's pick it up. And then as far as makeup, I went ahead and pick up the two new Natasha Denona Glam Face Palettes. Right now you have perhaps already watched my review on these two babies. I did side-by-side -side comparisons and in fact, I'm using one of them right here. Let me show them to you. They are just so pretty. They are just fingerprint central for sure, but this is the one that I'm using today on my face the dark version is just so stunning so beautiful the new formulation of the blush is gorgeous and then this new formula right here is this one right here is the one that i have in the middle of my eyelid it's just a spectacular you don't need to wet it to get this intensity it's just very very like intense but beautiful and you know what? I don't find fallout or flakes or anything like that. I don't find any gatherings also on my eyelids. Wow, it's such a stunning palette. And then I also love the light version. I think this is good for every day. If you're shopping for somebody that you know that they love makeup or perhaps they like makeup but they don't have like a big collection and you know that, you know, these are for every day. So I think Natasha Denona, she did honestly an excellent job in creating these palettes right here. The tones are really well done, perfect for, this is more like for light, light to medium skin tones, those who have fair skin tone too. And this one perfect for those who have medium, tan, and tan and deep skin tones I mean they are just so so good if you haven't watched my review I will say go ahead and watch it don't miss it out because I also give you a ton of comparisons with other palettes from Natasha Denona super great great quality and to me an amazing lunch for Natasha Denona and you know my friends this Sephora holiday savings event is a perfect time to actually pick up some fragrances and the one that I had been like you know I wanted on my collection is Coco Noir by Chanel. And honestly, I mean like, you cannot get discounts on Chanel at all. I mean like, makeup, ah, never. I, I haven't seen any website that you can get a discount on Chanel at all. And that goes also for fragrances, but with Sephora, I'm able to get my Chanel fragrances with my discount, which that makes me super, super happy. And I love Coco Noir. Oh, and the bottle. The bottle is so beautiful, so elegant. This fragrance has notes of grapefruit, bergamot, orange, jasmine, patchouli, sandalwood, tonka bean, white mask, clove. Mm, 
you know what? I haven't put any fragrance right now, so let's go for it. Oh my gosh. This is one of those, the ultimate fragrance for that very elegant woman. You know, it's elegance. Coconut is just elegance in a bottle. Not only for the black bottle, but the fragrance itself is it's just sophisticated. It has a little bit of that clove and the bergamot and the orange and the grapefruit. That is, life is not super citrus because it does have the vanilla in it and that little bit of mask that just makes it all like grounded, you know, and it smells again so sophisticated, so elegant. One of my favorite fragrances from Chanel. Coco Noir and oh my god, I'm just super super happy to get it back on my collection. I bought another couple fragrances, but they haven't arrived yet. You will see them, you will see them soon. I went ahead and also pick up something from Tom Ford. This is one of his gloss looks. You know, guys, I do have a collection of these, but he actually had come out with new shades, and I thought, you know, why not? Most of the new shades are, yeah, exception for this one right here, they were all sold out. So I'm checking back here and there, but honestly, this is actually one that I personally really wanted. It's called In The Buff, and this is my type of lip gloss. This kind of like goldy, bronze gloss shade, oh, and the packaging is just so beautiful. I'm sure you're not going to be able to see, yeah, it's, you know, almost transparent right there right here but yeah i mean this is my type of lip gloss super beautiful sorry you're not gonna be able to see it right there but you will see it in action sometime soon here on my channel but i was just really really wanting to get another lip gloss and i'm happy it was this one there was another pinky one too i may end up getting that one if it comes back in the stock if not that's okay and then also from tom four i picked up another lipstick this one right here is sable smoke and this is such a gorgeous peachy nude shade not too peachy it's still on that neutral side but it has a little bit more warmth to it it's just such a perfect perfect nude and there's another one too that is more pink leaning ah oh, what's the name flesh i think i'm gonna pick up that one if it's still available too that i mean having a nude lipstick and mostly on tone four yes and this is honestly the right time the holiday viv sale from sephora is the right time to pick up this type of you know more expensive products but that they are actually worth it and then if you follow me on instagram you must have seen me on my stories i went shopping with my oldest daughter and we got this baby right here this is the dyson airwrap complete and this is in the limited edition 2021 with this beautiful blue and bronze tone right here. Now, is this for me? No, that is something that my oldest daughter, she decided to pick that up because you know, guys, I already have my Dyson Air Wrap. I rave about it all the time. I love it. I feel that is the best investment. I will repurchase it again. And she has been using it too. And I'm not opposed for her to use it at all and whatsoever, but then she saw it and then she went like, ah, I like it. I want it. And you know what? She works. She's such a great kid. She works. She saves her money. And she said, mom, you know, as long as you let me use your discount, I will get it. So she got it. And actually, in fact, I will be sharing with all of you guys my hair care routine and how I style my hair with the Dyson Airwrap. So stay tuned for that. Make sure you have that post notification bell on. But here it is. Oh, so pretty, so beautiful with a beautiful casing. This right here is magnetic. And as you open it up right here, you have these thing right here that you can place on top your air wrap and then all the different attachments right here you get the round brush right here also two of these that are to straight and sleek your hair there's two different ones and then you get this nozzle right here that i actually use it quite a bit this is to dry your hair it actually to me kind of has replaced my dyson hair dryer i still have it i still use it from time to time but honestly my go-to is my air wrap and then you get two of these attachments right here the two barrels and then two other ones that they are the slimmer barrels and 
here you go this is it this is the other barrel right here a lot of smaller the air wrap i mean this is just ah oh, so 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 gorgeous this is amazing and then this time around they included it this travel bag this beautiful pouch for your air wrap i think this is amazing this is awesome that they included something like that because with the first one they didn't include this right here so this is definitely a great great addition so i'm just super excited to see it it's not mine it's my daughter's you know but i feel like oh, it's just so pretty so beautiful i love the color it's very elegant just very chic and i, I love this combination of blue and the brown stone i think it just looks very very nice oh my goodness so yeah that's something that i just want to share with you you know guys i have mine you know guys that i rave about it um but yeah my daughter decided to pick up one and i just wanted to show it to you so you know how it looks and all that jazz talking still about hair i went ahead and pick up this living proof perfect hair day advanced clean dry shampoo and i have heard great things about this dry shampoo in fact i have tried the living proof dry shampoo the regular one but this one is advanced clean and it actually not only cleans your hair but it also gives it shine now my hair is right now clean i just wash it i just style it so there's no point for me to use it but definitely i will be reporting back about this one because i only heard like people raving about it that this is the best dry shampoo and to me the best best dry shampoos that i have tried so far are from igk first class the detox one that's amazing i love the one from sol de janeiro with the boom boom scent oh mm, so so good but i just really want to try this one because usually with dry shampoos your hair will just look you know like mm, kind of clean but again kind of like a little bit dull you know it's not so perfect although the one from oribe the dry shampoo that's really nice one too it doesn't leave you know like a you know like a cast of like dullness but this one that it says that gives you shine got me really curious going into another little gift set right here i told you guys that i was gonna pick up this westman atelier this is the clean glow trio and this one is in the number two so this little set right here comes with a bronzer a blush and a highlighter and the number two comes with the shade truffle which is I mean this is a really good shade there's a shade biscuit which is the lighter version and honestly i didn't like that one too much not not the formulation i love the formulation basically what i didn't like about it is the tone it's a little bit too cool tone for me while truffle kind of meets in the middle between a contour and a bronzer you know not too cool tone not too warm it's just perfect and then the highlighter in the shade nectar which is stunning this is a gorgeous gorgeous highlighter and then here i have a blush in the shade doo doo such a beautiful pink tone oh this is just so so pretty and i love the size too these are perfect for traveling you know like take it on the go or if you're discovering the brand westman atelier this is a really good way to go about it for a gift too i think for a gift this is just perfect i mean the box is just so delicate and exquisite look at this you just put you know imagine a little i don't know like a little gold bow right here and it will just look ready set and go I and mean, it's so beautiful and they have also another trio which is a lighter version but I really wanted to get the number two. It's just so pretty and I think the value is completely there. And then talking about Westman Atelier, I went ahead and picked up her bronzer. So this is something that I don't have in my collection from her. I do love her highlighters, her blushes, and her foundation too is really nice. But I had been skipping for a while her bronzer. So I picked it up in the shade Soleil Riche which is the richest out of the two packaging super super pretty this is Westman Atelier and then oops <laughs> came with this protector right here and I love the little hearts I mean so on brand very lovely a nice size mirror and her packaging is just so nice and weighty and just so luxurious very pretty also from westman atelier i picked up another one of her blushes i know so many blushes 
I mean, honestly, her blushes are really beautiful. They do have pigment, but not too much. They have a little bit of translucency, but they are very easy to blend, apply. They last a good time. Packaging is delightful too. Love the Vermeni packaging. And Shushet is a shade that I had been eyeing for a while, and I think this is beautiful. Yeah, this is a lovely shade. Ooh. Yeah, this is an everyday shade. Totally, totally love, lovely shade. So I'm super excited to try these ones right here. Honestly, Gucci Westman and West, her brand, Westman Atelier. It's honestly made for the everyday elegant woman that likes her makeup to be easy going, simple, yet an statement. Totally love. Was my Natalia. And talking about gift sets, I picked up the Lash Stash to go, and this is a really good way to discover different mascaras because you get all these five different mini mascaras. The Buy Beauty one that you know, guys, is my favorite mascara right now. In fact, I have it on my lashes today. By the way, I will be leaving all the details of the products that I'm talking about today in the description box below, as well as what I'm using as far as makeup goes and all that jazz. But going back to this one, you also get a mini one of the Milk Makeup, then the mascara from Huda Beauty, as well as the Pat McGrath Dark Star Mascara. That's a really good mascara. And an OG one to the Too Faced Better Than Text Mascara. So this is a really good way to discover different mascaras. But for me, specifically, inside there is a voucher that you can trade that voucher, you know, after you try all of these mascaras for one of these mascaras in the regular size, in the large size. And I'm like, this is perfect because I really need to get my Bi Beauty mascara back because it's almost, you know, it's almost done. It's right there. So this will be perfect. I will trade it and that's it. So for me, this is a perfect set for myself, for a gift, because mascaras, we really need to rotate them every three months at the most because it grows bacteria and all of that. So I thought definitely to pick it up. And honestly, I usually use this mascara little set every single Sephora sale, no matter whether it's a holiday or the spring one, but I always pick it up. And then another set that I picked up is the Lola's Forget the Filler Lip Plumping Line Smoothing Gloss Mini Trio. So I have heard the best about this specific lip plumper. It really, mac I mean like it makes your lip look like you have had, you know, some injections right there. <laughs> Something like that, you know, more plump, more juicy, more youthful too. And I really like the idea to have three different ones, you know? I mean, I can use one, I can give another one to somebody, you know, one for my daughter, I don't know. But I thought it was fun, something different, and I really wanted to try also the formulation. And I really like Lola's Beauty. I really love her eyeshadows. They are really, really good. Talking about eyeshadows, I picked up something from Charlotte Tilbury. These I have been eyeing it for a while, but haven't picked it up, and I think because the holidays are coming, you know, New Year's Eve and whatnot, I decided to pick up the Rock Chic. And, ooh, this is a dream of a cool tone gray quad. Oh my goodness. I, I don't know. This just was calling my attention. I was like mesmerized about it. It's like, I should get it right. Yes, I should get it. And I finally, you know, like pulled the trigger. I'm like, let me get it. I really wanted it to give it a try, give it a go. Let me switch this right here. Oh my gosh, look at that. I love cool tones. That's very lovely. Look at that. Oh my gosh, I'm just super excited to give it a go right here. This looks very pretty. I love cool tones eyeshadow palettes. I'm talking about cool tones and shadow palettes. I picked up something from Huda Beauty. You know, guys, when I was reviewing the Rose Quartz eyeshadow palette, which I think is perhaps the best eyeshadow palette from Huda Beauty, I also mentioned it that I was having from the Wild Obsessions collection, the Jower palette, and I got it. Oh my goodness. And this is, again, oh my gosh, look at this. Another cool tone dream. Isn't it this gorgeous? I love the combination of these kind of like very muted, they're not purple, they are between a, not even mauve, like kind of lavender and just like, oh my gosh, it looks so beautiful. These are totally my shade, so I'm just super excited to give it a try. It looks so pretty. 
I'm sure many of you perhaps already have it, but this one right here is one that I had been eyeing it and eyeing it, and I said, you know, this is the time to get it. Then I went ahead and picked up another one of my Super Goop Unseen Sunscreen. This is a sunscreen that I use it from time to time because it's, you cannot see it. It basically goes on clear, is really nice, but also my son, he uses it. It's really good, nice. It doesn't really mattify, you know, but it just, again, goes on clear, super easy to apply. It's not super thick either. And in fact, I didn't only pick that one, I picked up more than one. And then I also picked up this Laneige set of lip masks. You know, my friends, I love these lip masks from Laneige. And I actually have a couple, you know, on backup. So I said, you know, I really do not need a full one because a full one lasts me for six to eight months, pretty much. I mean, like, you just need a little and a little goes a long way. But I also like to keep it on my purse and I also wanted to, you know, try other variations, other scents right here. So they have their traditional one, the first one that I think is a berries, gummy bear, which is one of my favorite. And then this set also comes with sweet candy, which I haven't tried yet. Here I have something, I think this is peppermint or something mint and then lemon sorbet. So I thought, you know what, this is super cute. And also if you're planning for a gift for a teenager or a younger person or just a little something something for somebody, this is a really, really nice gift set because actually this lip balm is amazing. Honestly, it helps with chopped lips. It's a really, really good lip balm. And then I went ahead and also pick up this Tower 28 Sunny Days SPF 30. So another SPF, but this one is a tinted one. And I picked it up in the shade Ocean Park. So I'm super excited to give it a go because as you know, I love tinted SPF. My favorite one is the Elta MD one, but when I saw Tower 28 bringing one, I really love what Tower 28 has brought to the table. So I don't know, I just felt like, mm, this is something for me. It says here that is alcohol free, fragrance free, non irritating. It's made with powerhouse skincare ingredients that help soothe the skin stress from UV, blue light, and environmental damage. It has white sage, prickly pear, which is an antioxidant, aloe, centella. Love centella too. And it says here that it's non greasy, natural finish, and it's also non nano reef safe mineral sunscreen. So this just makes me super excited for the brand and just to try it. I'm just very, very excited. The premier ingredient right here is zinc oxide 12.6%. So I'm excited about it to give it a go, give it a try right here. And then the last product that I picked up is this NARS Radiant Creamy Color Corrector. So I have heard great things about it. You know, guys, I love the one from Charlotte Tilbury, this one right here. And I have a still sub amount right there, but I said, you know what? I want to give it a try to something different. And I went ahead and pick up the one from NARS. Now I picked it up in the shade light. I was able to look it up in a store and I thought the shade medium was a little bit too dark for my skin tone so I picked up the light one. Okay my friends and I think this makes it for this whole video. I would love to know from you have you been shopping at the Sephora sale? Perhaps you already done and bored of all these recommendations videos, haul videos and whatnot but you know what I feel this is one of those big sales of the year or at least of the holidays and by the way do not forget if you're planning to shop the Sephora sale when you're at checkout make sure you use that code yay holiday and I want to take a moment and say thank you to all of you who are using my links to shop through the Sephora sale because you know that's the way that you support my channel it doesn't cost you anything and I greatly appreciate it and if you cannot and if you don't or you don't want to that's okay I'm just super happy to have you here it makes me really really happy anyhow friends I would love to know from you what have you picked up from the Sephora for a holiday savings event. What are those things that are still on your wish list that you don't know whether to get them or not? Let's continue the conversation on the comment section down below. And while you're at it, and if you haven't done so yet, I hope that you can give me that opportunity and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you ring that post notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads and come and follow me on my Instagram. If you like this video, do not forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, share with family and friends. And until next time, I hope you have a beautiful, wonderful day. Bye.